city councilor is facing assault charges tonight. It's a story we first told you about at 6 o'clock. And new tonight, we approached that city councilor for his side of the story. But as you can see, he wasn't having any part of it. Iowa to Sioux reporter Jared Pliner is live in Newport now with the new details for us. Mike Shetty, good evening. I guess you could call it a bit of a war of words. A sitting city councilor adamant that he will stay on the council despite legal troubles and a mayor who is adamant that his colleague needs to step down. Here's Newport City Councilor Mike Farley Wednesday pleading no contest to misdemeanor assault of a contractor back in June. State police tell us the physical fight stemmed from Farley's accusation that the worker stole a ladder from him. And here's Mike Farley at Wednesday night city council meeting after his arrest and court date. What was very clear? Mayor Harry Winthrop's opinion on what should happen next. I believe that at this point in time, Council of Folly should actually step down from the city council. To have that stigma on this council in this town is absolutely wrong. And so Eyewitness News tracked down the councilor as the meeting broke up. The mayor has asked you to step down. How do you respond to that? He was very strong in his terms tonight. The mayor would like me to step down, I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> you guys don't see eye to eye? <laughs> Not on much at all. Do you have any plans to do that? No, no, but thank you for the question. And as the door closed, a firm statement on remaining in office. I, I, I will. Obviously, if he's saying he's not stepping down, then he's clearly not doing what's best for the city. But only Farley and the voters can make that decision, and he's up for re-election in November. I think they should realize that the person that they thought they elected was not the person that is sitting in that seat today. The mayor with strong words about Farley's effectiveness in office. I don't think he's effectively done it since he got elected. Now, the mayor tells me absent a felony conviction, which this is not, sitting members cannot forcibly remove one of their own. By the way, Mike Farley has to keep stay out of trouble for a year, and if he does that, he stands to have that assault charge expunged from his record. He's also ordered by the judge to have no contact with his victim and to pay that man's medical bills, medical restitution. Live in East, uh, Newport tonight with East Bay Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jared Pletter, Eyewitness News.